information technology is booming. It is becoming normal practice for both corporations and private sectors to put private and delicate information onto secure networks. But are these networks really secure? That's the main question on every IT professional's brain. If they aren't, what happens after you've been hacked? That is the job for a computer hacking forensic investigator. In a perfect world, we wouldn't have to worry about who's accessing the information that was meant only for our eyes. But the harsh truth is that there are people out there who make it the goal of their game to get breach networks of all sizes. No matter the reasons behind them, hackers exist. We need to beat them, so we must think like them, and catch the holes and cracks in the infrastructures before they do. The people responsible for hacking these networks illegally and causing panic need to be held accountable for their actions and must be prosecuted. This introduces the need for cybersecurity professionals across every realm of IT. So why are these cybersecurity professionals needed? Well, millions, even billions of companies rely on the Internet to house important information and as a means of communication for numerous top secret discussions. As the amount of information being secured on the network increases, the amount of hackers trying to, and sometimes succeeding at, tapping into them is increasing exponentially. This accounts for cybersecurity being one of the fastest growing fields. EC Council is the main organization addressing the need for cybersecurity professionals. It was developed and created after the unimaginable terrorist attacks of September 11th. The security certifications instated by EC Council create a uniform standard across the board of IT professionals. These certifications ensure that the knowledge to protect companies remains in tip-top shape at all times. EC Council has also paved the way for over 80,000 new trained security professionals, including 30,000 trained at very advanced levels. The first line of defense against hackers is a CEH. CEH stands for Certified Ethical Hacker. This is, without a doubt, the EC Council's flagship program. It leads the way for all the other certs to follow. As you can guess by the information I've provided you so far, CEH is the hottest certification out there. It teaches you offensive hacking. That includes practicing penetration tests on networks to see where the holes and missing components are. Your goal as a CEH is to protect the client's network and keep unwanted visitors out. Having this certification will benefit auditors, site administrators, and security staff, just to name a few. The average annual salary of a CEH is about $92,000 a year. Hackers are very sly. They can wiggle their way into the smallest cracks and turn a company's network completely onto its head. Even the best CEH or penetration tester can't catch everything every single time. So let's just say that a hacker has worked his way into your information. He's got that illegally. Now you need a CHFI. A CHFI is a computer hacking forensic investigator. This is the person who's going to put together the pieces and clues and bring the malicious hacker to justice. This is done through very intensive computer investigations and analysis techniques, which will lead to successful prosecution. Having the ability to bring these guys down will benefit all IT professionals involved with security, forensics, and incident response. This sounds both interesting and fun, right? But how are you going to get certified? First, you'll need to take a CHFI boot camp to prepare yourself for the exam. This should be done at an EC Council ATC to ensure you are getting instruction from a facility and instructor approved by EC Council themselves. After you complete the boot camp, you will take exam 312-49. This is supplied by Prometric and proctored at ATCs. The exam is 150 questions, which requires at least 70% right to correct pass. Once you are certified, you cannot ignore the required continuing education credits. You need to compile 120 credits within three years. 20 of these credits must be acquired each year. So you can't wait until the last year and scramble to attain all 120. No matter how many certs you hold through EC Council, the number of CECs required remains the same. Once you're certified, you'll be looking for employment if you don't already have a job in the field. The good news is that cybersecurity is a very lucrative business. There is both demand and supply, therefore there's money to be made. A CHFI can expect a starting salary of $85,000 up to $120,000 a year, depending on years in the field. These jobs will include law enforcement, defense, and military personnel, as well as various IT administrators and managers. The amount of money you can expect to receive from an employer varies considerably. The federal government is going to pay the most, while state agencies will pay you the least. The delicacy of the information you are working to protect will also help gauge your salary. Being that you're highly trained and knowledgeable professional, you'll be very marketable to international companies. Most foreign countries have their own code of conduct in place, which you'll need to become familiar with if you travel down this road, but the important forensic ability remains the same no matter what country or continent you're working on. Cybercrime can cost companies billions of dollars, so they're going to pay you well in order to avoid the major financial detriments. 
You can be sure to find training and degree programs in every state, which will aid in what your worth is to a potential employer. This is a list of some of the major cities in the U.S. and what you can be expected to be paid as a CHFI. As in any career, your salary will alter based on the cost of living in the area you reside. Let's take a look at a few which illustrate this. New York City pays upwards $100,000 a year to CHFIs, but it also costs a lot more to live in this city. Miami, Florida pays about $30,000 less at $71,000 a year. Portland, Maine is paying their CHFIs around $45,000 a year, but remember, this is all just averages, so you're not guaranteed to achieve this amount, and you may even get much more based on your skill level. Advanced Security by the Academy of Computer Education is proud to be Easy Council's two-time ATC of the year. We acquire this honor by providing the best subject matter experts that your money can buy. We offer advanced security courses which have been designed by the SMEs themselves and aren't offered anywhere else. These courses include mobile hacking and cyber war, just to name a few. The amount of hands-on labs and demonstrations provided in our courses is unrivaled by anyone in the industry. With convenient locations in both Greenbelt, Maryland and Ashburn, Virginia, we're well situated to provide your training solutions. Call us today at 877-564-TRAIN to discuss our advanced security training courses as well as our off-site capabilities.